Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Pop Preview. I'm Sean. I'm Alex. And today we're watching the Avengers Endgame Super Bowl spot. I um I didn't catch this. Uh, I was watching the Super Bowl, or half watching it, because it wasn't very interesting. Uh, I totally missed this. I, I didn't watch it till afterwards when it went online. I was like, wait, when did that air? <laughs> I wasn't wa I wasn't watching the Super Bowl, so um, I obviously saw it online afterwards, but um, uh, we just wanted to do a review so you guys can get our thoughts on it, even though we've already seen it, mm -hmm. FYI, so we're not going to be like, oh my god, I haven't seen it yet. We don't want to lie. We don't want to lie. So, it's um... Honesty. Complete honesty. Yeah, so let's just uh, watch it and then we can get our thoughts and... Sweet. Yeah. Let's do it. Some people... Move on. Not us. All right. Wow. No. Ah. Could watch it again, but we yeah, to we could. I probably will. Later. Um. So, what are your thoughts? I I liked the energy. Like it wasn't. There's mm -hmm. obviously no humor in this, um, no, which we... sometimes they'll they'll do. Like at the end of the first trailer yeah. that we saw, we saw the the funny Ant Man thing, um, which I, I I really hate that about trailers. Like it's it's totally a thing to just put the humor, the humor, the comedy thing yeah. at the end. But we talked about. It. I mean, I think it for that trailer it kind of makes sense. I I, I get <laughs> yeah. what you're saying that it's a trope, but I think yeah. in that trailer it makes sense because how dire the <laughs> all the trailer was to try to leave you with a little bit of hope so yeah but i'm glad that we don't have any hope <laughs> no, <I'm kidding. laughs> no actually it is a very hopeful this trailer even though like it's really kind of intense because yeah. everyone's like oh no you don't oh no you don't we're not mm -hmm. gonna lie down we're not gonna take this lying down and uh everyone's suiting up and mm -hmm. walking like a badass and uh, i don't know it got me excited and we see you know captain america has no beard anymore no. and uh also has his shield yeah and um, what else did we see? I don't know. I mean, all the characters kind of training and well, get, getting yeah, ready. Getting ready. I mean, first off, I mean, hats off to Disney and Marvel for spending five million dollars on a, on a thirty second ad, not really showing you anything of <laughs> substance in the sense that like we don't see any battle scenes, we don't see any mm -hmm. of that stuff, and it goes to show you that you can um, have a trailer or a mm -hmm. TV spot in a sense. You don't really have to show us a lot of anything, and we can still get hyped and excited yeah. about it. So, uh, like, other studios, look at this. Like, 30-second spot on the Super Bowl, all these eyes watching, really didn't show us anything of, of substance that you would normally see in a spot like that to engage us. And we really didn't get a lot of anything. And if Kevin Feige is going by his word, and I believe him, that everything we're seeing happens in the first 20 minutes... Mm. Even the first twenty minutes, there's a lot to dissect. There's a lot to analyze. Like yeah. when we first watch it, when you when the spot first starts, we see a lot of the heroes that that have been dusted. We saw, you know, a Wasp, a Spider Man, um, Black Panther, um, Falcon, all the heroes that that got dusted, and then we start to see like you know Iron Man and Nebula. It looks like they're working on something. So I'm thinking that. Contrary to what everybody thought with that speech that Iron Man's giving in the first trailer, yeah. where he's like speaking to Pepper, I think that does happen at the beginning. I think at one point, maybe he does give up, and then um, Tony and Nebula are work. you know, she probably like, you know, like, figures out a way to save them, and I think that's what they're working on. It kind of, the way he's working on that kind of echoes back to Iron Man 1 when he's working on his um, first um, Iron Man suit. So there's, there's, there's just a lot to dissect in this 30 seconds, and it's... Yeah. Pretty remarkable. Well, that was the only thing I didn't really like about this trailer. It was like, I really liked the, you know, the tugging of the emotional heartstrings of mm -hmm. the last trailer where you see Tony and we're not sure if he's going to make it out. Yeah. But kind of now we know, like, oh, he's probably going to be fine. Well, he, he, he may be fine. <laughs> so, he may be fine. Yeah, I don't know. But... That was the only thing I wish they wouldn't have given us is that, that clip right there where they're working on something together. Well, I mean, because, again, if you think, if we go by the fact that all this is in the first 20 minutes. Maybe that does happen at the beginning. Yeah. 
and maybe they do figure something I'm sure, out. I'm sure it does. Yeah. Um, and I'm not saying this doesn't tell us that he's going to survive the yeah. whole movie, but I did. I wish they would have just left it like that. Oh man, Iron Man. Oh no, yeah. oh, he's so alone and he's not going to make it. Um, and then we see like Thor looking out somewhere. Could that be Thanos' planet? Some people think it's Wakanda. Mm. Uh. Hmm. I don't know what is he holding right there. It's hard to tell. It looks like an umbrella. I mean, that's probably that's probably sto- <laughs> that's probably Stonebreaker. Um, it looks but, like an umbrella. Right? I mean, from the, he's Mary yeah. Poppins. Mary Poppins flies in to help for sure. That's the twist. It's you know. <laughs> that's all Yondu. The Disney. That's Yondu. Yondu. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the, I mean, there's so much to to break down this. I'm just skimming forward through it. Mm-hmm. Now, towards the end, when they're walking out like that, a lot mm-hmm. of people think that. Somebody was digitally removed mm. from like right there mm-hmm. um, when they're walking in like the yeah. Avengers hangar. It looks like yeah, toward that the back of the it's line. It's possible that maybe maybe Captain Marvel is there at this point because we yeah. haven't seen Captain Marvel, yet, so we don't know exactly where she comes in at. I still find when. it interesting that they would take that time and money to when they could just show us a different shot. I mean, but... <laughs> you know I, what I mean? I mean, they, they've done it before. When, I know. In, in it the is, first... Uh, right, with Hulk and... Well, the, with the Hulk and, and then the, the, the Infinity Stones. Yeah. So they've done that before. Yeah, because I just it, find it funny. Because if you're like, hey, I really like the shot, but if Captain Marvel or somebody we don't want to reveal is there yet, yeah. let's just digitally take them out. I mean, because, like, why else would there be a big gap when they're walking like that? Someone's lagging. Who is that? So, I mean... <laughs> Who's like a mother there? But I can't even tell who that is. Is that Ant Man? Well, Ant Man is is one of them. So like, but yeah, it's uh, gotta zoom in, enhance, <laughs> enhance. <laughs> and then we get that shot with Tony and his shield. I mean, I I really like that. So apparently, and and one of my friends uh, brought this up to me is that in Spider Man Homecoming, when they're clearing out Avengers Tower, one of the things that Happy Hogan is mentioning is Cap's new shield. And we're, we're mm-hmm. maybe that's the shield he actually has in this one because we actually don't see the front of it. We only see the him strapping it on. Yeah. So maybe Cap gets a brand new shield, not the same shield he had before, because he obviously didn't have the shield in Avengers: um, Infinity War. So ah, there's just there's just there's just so much. So many questions. But so that, many questions. That's what makes a good trailer, though. So yeah, I mean, and to review the trailer itself and not the content, I thought it was a well edited. Uh, they picked the right moments. Oh, I agree. Um, and, and the it was fact just that long enough. It was and the good. fact that this isn't even like this is even a trailer. This is just a, a TV it's spot. Teaser kind of. Even. Yeah, and then yeah. I mean, like, like obviously that's Black Widow there shooting and the, you know keeping her sharps up. There's Ant Man. There's War Machine. I mean, there's just everybody's there. I mean, just well, everybody that we we <laughs> officially know no, survived, survived. Yeah, is there. And yeah. again, I'm assuming if if they did edit it out. Maybe so, like I said, I, I'm pretty sure if I want to take a bet, it's Captain Marvel. Um, but obviously we won't know that for sure until I doubt trailer two or until we see Captain Marvel. Right. Which is coming up. Which is coming up pretty soon. And this movie's coming on, like, we're February now. Like, it's, <laughs> ah. it's, it's end of April. It's not that far away. So I'm, yeah. we might get, we're probably going to get one more trailer. I don't know if we'll get two by mm-hmm. by. The end of April. I think we're just gonna get one more. One's good. And yeah, obviously with with this and one more trailer, I think we're good. Considering again, I hate to keep bringing it up, but if he if we're sticking with that first twenty minutes thing, then I only think we only need one more. Yeah, and I think in that trailer they're gonna give us something that's gonna make us be like, like whoa, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I that's I think really so. gonna be like. Oh, Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, like like probably like right after Captain Marvel comes yeah, out. They'll that's drop what, yeah. some kind of knowledge bomb on us or we'll see some character or something's something will happen. Um well, yeah, I mean, that'll we'll, make us probably raise more questions, but yeah, also absolutely. get us ex- even more excited. Yeah, because they kinda of did that with the first one because we saw at the end we saw Ant Man and we're like, like how did he Whoa, get out of, he, he get out of the, the quantum realm? So that yeah. that was kind of a like yeah. so I kind of agree with you. They might do something with the second one. Mm-hmm. Just be like, whoa, like, how did how did this happen? What Like, what does that mean? Yeah. And we won't f- truly find out until we actually sit in the movie. Yes. So if we're only seeing... Imagine, guys, if we're only seeing the first 20 minutes, this movie might be two and a half hours. So there might be like two hours and ten minutes of stuff we're not going to see until we actually walk into the theater. And that is super, super refreshing. We're not seeing the end battle scene. We're not yeah. seeing anything. Yeah. 
And like, how, how often can you say that going in that you know for a fact that you haven't seen anything from like the middle or end of the movie, which nowadays is almost unheard of. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's true. So, um, I mean, I, any of the final thoughts or? No, I no. just, I'm happy with this one. Oh, I'm super happy about this one, considering it's not that far away, guys. Oh, what do you guys think? Let's start the comments below. Do you think they edited somebody out? What are your thoughts about what we're seeing, about Tony and Nebula, about about Ant-Man and War Machine, about the guy, they're walking out there. Do you think that's Captain Marvel or do you think it's somebody else? What do you guys think? Let us know. Start the comments below. Also, like and subscribe. Do all those great things like you guys have been doing. So far, we've been getting great support since we started the channel till now. So thank you, everybody. Uh, keep it up. Um, and also, make sure to ring that bell to be notified when our next trailer reviews hit or when we actually do the review for the movie itself. That's going to be... Uh, I can guarantee you that's going to be a long discussion. I, get, I can guarantee you that. <laughs> yeah. Um, so look forward to that. And until next time, I'm Sean. I'm Alex. Bye, guys. Bye.